So this article says India UAE Inc pact for civil nuclear cooperation. MOU signed during the visit of Sheikh Khalid bin Mohammed bin Zayed Al Nahyan Al Nahyan Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi to New Delhi agreement between NPCIL and UAE's Barak Baraka nuclear plant In a first India and the UAE on Monday signed a memorandum MOU for civil nuclear cooperation So civil nuclear cooperation like it's it's just an agreement which allows the exchange of nuclear technology and materials between countries but only for peaceful purposes the goal is to generate energy and heat from uranium atoms without producing a greenhouse without producing greenhouse gases it's mostly energy related and things like that yeah so basically when india did its pokhran tests pokhran one was it was code named smiling buddha <laughs> what a name in 1974 and it was the first nuclear test that india did and it was conducted by the indian army under the supervision of several key indian generals and pokhran 2 was the second test when we did five nuclear tests code named operation shakti took place on may 11 and 13th 1998 so this when we did the 1998 test everyone was mad they were like super mad they were like oh how can you guys do this like us and all these p5 countries who wanted who basically wanted nuclear nuclear energy and nuclear power and nuclear not energy nuclear weapons to just remain with them so these are the countries which basically lost it they were like oh how can you guys do it ah uh, all that they started putting up sanctions and all it was spearheaded by the us of course so yeah later on in 2005 we signed this 1 2 3 agreement between prime minister manmohan singh and uh, president george w bush uh, and this was the first india like you know in us india civil nuclear agreement and this deal basically you know was the balancing factor it made like a, it made the whole nuclear tests and everything like a zero sum game uh, and it 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 also spoke about you know weapons transfer and different Yeah so different agreements let's say if India was at war and we needed something i think it was called moa or something and we have one with us we have one with france we have one with japan we have even one with the uk so having having one with japan is like you know critical because japan is the only country on the entire globe to have been hit by a nuclear weapon and those guys believing the fact that you know India can be a good peaceful partner for them it's it's the belief that they have put in us grateful to them so we have this PSU which takes care of all of the signing of such such agreements and things like that so it's called nuclear power cooperation uh, power corporation of india limited npcil which is a PSU which is based in mumbai and maharashtra and is responsible for the generation of electricity from nuclear power it is administered by the D- department of atomic energy it was created in september 1987 under the companies act of 1956 okay fine so the same thing in uh, in the uae is called enec it's emirates nuclear energy company it's pretty straightforward So both of them signed the deal. Oh, nice. So basically, this is this is one of the questions which was asked in the Rajya Sabha. It was an unstarred question, number two eight one two, to be answered on eleventh August two thousand sixteen. Sri Nirad Shekhar asked. So you know, basically, all the questions and all the answers and everything is documented in, in like structurally so that so that. basically a lot 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 of people can refer to it and we can refer to it ourselves and we can see that we can see the progress of how our country has evolved and things like that but yeah so this is one of the questions which was asked in 2016 by shri nira chekar and he asks will the will the minister of external affairs be pleased to state a the details of the countries which have signed nuclear treaties or pacts with india 
and like two more questions so this is what is relevant for us india has signed civil nuclear cooperation agreements with france the united states russia namibia canada argentina kazakhstan republic of korea shek republic australia sri lanka and the united kingdom uh, an mou has been has also been signed with mongolia in december 2015 india and japan exchanged a memorandum as per which both sides confirmed having reached agreement on an agreement for cooperation in the peaceful uses of nuclear energy in 2024 we india and uae have also linked the pact so that that is that is some good progress by india so there was india japan after 2016 where you know pm modi and uh, pm shinzo abe who were good friends may his soul rest in peace i think after that that's pretty much about it about this